Hi everyone, in this tutorial, I will show you how to blend images seamlessly in Canva to create a beautiful and impactful environmental poster. Let's get started and make a design that inspires change. In Canva, I will choose Instagram post portrait here. And then for the plus, I will set the background. Go to element. And I will add a dirt element like this. And then set it as background. And then I will add a square and I will increase the size like this. And then click this color button and click one more and click gradient. And then I will choose this linear gradient. Now I'll change it to this red and also this one to the same red. Select the second color and then reduce the opacity or transparency to zero. All right, and then I will reduce this transparency to 75. And then I will add a wall crack illustration element and place it here. Now I will add a new page and I will add a hand element and remove the background I will rotate it 90 degree and then add a square I will increase the size of the square and then send it to back and change the color of the square to this yellow now select the hand go to edit and choose dual tone and choose custom. I will make it all white. So click the highlight color and change it to white and the shadow on also to white. Now download this page too. As PNG. And then select the hand, go to edit, go to dual tone and click custom again. Now select the yellow rectangle and remove it. And then upload the PNG of page to here. Remove the background. And then increase the size to fit the page. Now I will add another element, these three branches, broken branches, and then remove the background and go to apps and type easy. Choose Easy Reflection and select this icon. Click this button. Choose Above. Add the Opacity to 100. And reduce the Offset to about 32. And then Add to Design. Now remove the Origin element of the branch. And then use this one. Increase the size. Now go to Position layers and then send the branch between the hand and the frame and then select the hand and crop it like this and then select the frame and crop it here and then select the background and change the color of the background to the same yellow as the frame now download it as png page 2 only and then go to page 1 upload the png of page 2 here Use BG Remover to remove the background yellow. Okay, and then click BG Remover once again. And then I will erase it like this. And erase this part. Alright, now close it. And then I will crop this box. Like this and increase the size. Now duplicate this hand. Separate them and select the origin. Go to edit. And then choose dual tone. Custom and change the highlight to black. And the shadow to black. And then close. And then back. And then choose blur. And then click whole image. And intensity add to 50. Enter. Close it. And then place this hand here. 
like this. So now it has shadow. All right, and then let's uh, select the shadow, go to position and select the shadow, and then duplicate and click BG remover, and then remove it and remove this part. All right, increase the size of the brush. Now close it. Okay, and then place it right on the second hand. And reduce the transparency about 75 to make it more realistic. Okay, now go to position, select these three hands and group them. I will rotate it like this and increase the size. I will rotate more. Place it here. And then I will add some element. I will add this hand holding green plant and then remove the background. I only need the plant, so click BGD Wars again and then erase it manually and then close it I'll place it here and then add this blue shadow I'll reduce the size I'll place it here and duplicate place right on the origin and then I will add another blur I will add this one and then I will add this blue shadow I will reduce the size like this and place it here connect to the plan and duplicate place the duplicate right on the origin and then I will add a more rounded shadow like this one Reduce the size and reduce the, I mean reduce the transparency. And reduce the size also. I'll place it here. And duplicate, place it here. Okay. Now let's add some text. I'll add a text. I will change the font to Antonio. Okay. And then I will type here. I'll change the green to light typeface and uh, today I will make it extra bold and I will separate them and select all change the alignment to left and then reduce the line spacing and change the color all to white and then I will duplicate it Brad tomorrow select the both and then align elements and click left and then I will increase the size like this and then go to position and send them behind the hand now select the element of the plan and then group them and the text also we will group it and then select the this three group and slide to the left like this and then I will slide this crack to the center like this all right so now we have it if you like this tutorial please share to your social media see you next video and have fun with Canva